everyone, this is Maria, and today I have a small haul to share with you from Joann's, Target, the 99 cent store, and the Dollar Tree. So let's get started. And so I was at Joann's three times in the same week. I went yesterday looking for some spring items. I wanted a doormat. I already had my Valentine doormat, which I'm really happy with, but I wanted a spring doormat because it seems like the days and then the weeks are already going by so fast and I'm going to be needing a doormat for spring. And so I got this butterfly. Isn't this pretty? I just love this. And so this was $19.99 and it was marked 30% off because Joann's already marked all of their spring 30% off. And so I tried to use a 20% off total purchase, a Joann coupon for 20% off total purchase so I can get an additional savings besides the 30%. I thought that would be really nice. And so, but their cash register wouldn't accept it. Fortunately, it was a manager who was at the checkout stand. And so she called to ask just to make sure that she could accept a Michael's competitor coupon, which I had for 25% off. And so the cash register accepted it. And so I got an additional savings. So I had 30 additional 25. So I paid about $12 and a few cents for this. Isn't this nice? So the next thing I purchased, which I also got an additional 25% off of, is this bicycle. Look at this. Isn't this cute? And so I had been eyeing this last week on my previous visits to Joann's. It's made of metal. It's really strong, sturdy. Even Joey thought so. Look at this basket. You could put flowers in here, like the silk flowers. And so that's what I plan to do. So I looked at Dollar Tree. I didn't find any flowers that I really liked yet. And so I think I'm going to be buying my flowers at Joanne Fabric and So the price, it was $49.99. Mm -mm. You know me, Maria is not going to pay $49.99 for this. But because it was 30% off and I got an additional 25% off, I got a really great deal on this too, you guys. And so I'm really happy with this. This is going to go right outside of our patio door on our patio. And it's going to look so pretty and springy with flowers. So the last thing I purchased at Joann's is this gallon size mason jar. It's a ball mason jar. I love these. And so you could put collectibles in here. And that's what I'm going to do. I have two others just like it. And so it was $24.99. I had a 60% competitor coupon from Michael's. So I got a really great deal on this too. More than half off, you guys. Totally worth it. And so she was having trouble at the register with this one with that coupon. So she just went to another register. This cashier was just really, really nice and just had a really happy attitude, which I really appreciated. And so, and I know that happens because I used to work at Joann's and I remember having to switch registers a couple of times when things didn't quite work out right. And so I love these jars, you guys. In the comments below, let me know if you have seen these or if you bought one of these and what do you use it for? And like I mentioned, I put some of my little collectibles, my little miniatures, and it's so much fun because then I can see them. It's a really nice way to display small things. And now let's head over to the Dollar Tree where I purchased these wreath hangers. I got two of the red ones. They also have these in white, which I've already purchased a white one. And I went back to get another red one here. And so you guys, I ended up buying two of them because I can always use these at Christmas, right? And so for a dollar, these are a really great deal. Also at the Dollar Tree, oh my gosh, I hauled this before. So this is a Maria rerun this little plush doggy, and it says XOXO. They have these in, I think it was in tan also, but I really love this. Look under the ears, there's little hearts. And so my cats really love this. Even Oreo, who's an older cat, was playing with the one I purchased. So I bought an extra one to give to the cats out in the garage. We have the stray kitties that we feed and take care of. And so I always think of them too and buy the little toys. I figure if Oreo and Cam Cam enjoy this, so will the other little kitties. So cute. And then I purchased this little pink monkey. Look at this. It's adorable. And these also came in different colors. And I thought Cam Cam and Oreo would enjoy this too. And I thought, why didn't I buy two of them? I don't know. So the next time I go to Dollar Tree, I'll probably buy another one of these. And so I just think they're gonna have a lot of fun with this. And it was only a dollar and it's so cute. And then the Dollar Tree had these really adorable treat bags. Look how cute with the little kitty. 
and it says, Happy Valentine's Day. There's 20 in the package, and it comes with the little twisty ties. So I'm going to fill these up with treats for my friends for Valentine's Day. And like I mentioned, you guys, it's going to be here like so fast, like that, right? And then I got one more thing at the Dollar Tree. I still have to buy candy for the treat bags. These are for me, you guys. And I love the Russell Stover candies at the Dollar Tree. These are strawberry cream and white fudge and they just look so good you guys i have been trying to be so good since christmas because i can't even tell you how much candy and cookies and everything that i had right i mean today when i was at target i was so tempted to buy some but i'm gonna hold off just a little bit longer before i fill up the treat bags for my friends otherwise they're going to disappear but anyways what i love about these packages too is they don't have that many and so that's perfect for so me. the next item i'm going to show you is from the 99 cent only store this is a cat toy i saw about a week ago when i was at the corona 99 cent store but i didn't pick them up because they were two dollars and 99 cents each and if i was going to buy them i would buy two one for our kitties in the house and the ones for the garage i don't like to leave them out because there are babies too and so today we stopped at the redlands 99 after our grocery shopping trip to target and trader joe's and I saw them, and so I picked them up for $2.99 each. Look at this little toy. It's got faux fur all the way around, and the sun is shining through so you can see how sparkly it is. And it's got this little springy thing. You can see how sturdy it is. And you can see the little ball at the top with the feathers. Cam Cam loves feathers. So it's called a Cat Coil Interactive Toy, Irresistible Fun for Cats promotes interactive play and hours of fun. I believe it, you guys, because I'm having fun. <laughs> but anyways, $2.99, I thought was a great deal, so I did get two of these, and the green one was pretty too. Okay, so we went to Target this morning. That's where we do some of our grocery shopping. We get our cat food there, we buy some groceries and some different things. We just love Target. I mean, who doesn't love Target, right? And so I really love the Redlands Target, which by the way, you guys, they are remodeling the store. I mentioned that in my last haul. And so you guys, this morning we went and they already had like all the new freezers and refrigerators. There were just aisles of them and that's where the seasonal stuff was. So I am making a video. Hopefully I'll make enough video clips, film clips that I could put together, you guys. And so it's going to take six months for the total re remodel of the store. That's what I was told this morning. And so, because Maria is nosy and I ask questions. And so, but anyways, it's really exciting to see the changes happening. It was already a nice store. I already love it. That's why we drive there, but it's gonna be extra nice now. But let me show you what I got. I got some Valentine towels. And so, let's see, it's kind of bright there. You could see that. It says, I love you, I love you, I love you. And look how cute. And then on the front one, it says, I love you. And so <laughs> this is going to look really cute hanging on our stove. And I just really love this. And so I needed some kitchen towels. I hadn't found any yet that I really, really liked or fell in love with. And when I saw these this morning and they were $5 in the bullseye area, I said, I'm just going to take these. And so I just needed some towels for my kitchen. Now, if I could just find a drying mat for the kitchen counter with hearts on it or something, but I haven't seen anything. I may if I go over to Hobby Lobby, so we'll see if I can get over there. But anyways, just really like that. $5 was a great Joey deal. Joey and I, we went through the toy aisles, and I'm so glad that Joey loves toys as much as I do. We just have fun, and I think it's because we're both collectors. And so anyways, you guys, Joey spotted this. It's Duke Kaboom from Toy Story. Toy Story 4, it's a stunt racer, Duke Kaboom, recreates stunts from the movie. And it says that he's poseable. Let me show you the back. Look at that. This was only $9.98, regular $19.99. And I put off buying him when I was buying all of the other Toy Story things because he was $19.99. And I kept hoping that he would come down in price, and he did finally. He's half price, you guys. Really great deal. I love him. He's going with the rest of my collection. So excited. There are a few more Toy Story 4 things that I want to add to my collection, but I just have to be patient. Thanks for watching, everyone. I hope you're having a great day, and I hope you have a wonderful week. 
And I'll talk to you later, everyone. Bye. It's so rare that Oreo lets me pick him up. And so <laughs> until he wants to get down, say hi, Oreo. Say hi. And so anyways, you guys, thanks for watching. <laughs> Oreo was not going to have any of this. And so Cam Cam is so much more <laughs> cooperative. Maybe because he's little, but Oreo is so funny. We love him. Okay, bye everyone. Bye.